Good morning. <laughs> Happy Monday, y'all. Ready to pick up the slow the tires. Once again, we're going to Jacksonville this time. What you feel about it, baby? Well, them gas prices not me in the head. Diesel prices. They not me in the head. Fuel. Fuel. Um, we just paid $3.80. Three? Last week. Last week we paid three eighty eight and then quit trip by our house to get a little gas to, to get, get, a, get, a little to get a little fuel. Yeah, get a little fuel. And today diesel is four dollars and thirty nine cents. Now we gotta pay it. We gotta we $4. gotta thirty nine cents. I thought I'm saying three ninety nine. Oh, oh yeah, four dollars. Three ninety nine for Monday. How much is it? Four thirty nine. Four thirty nine, y'all. Man, so good <laughs> I don't care how much you make. Unbelievable. You don't want to be spending that high amount on diesel. You want to get all you can get in your pocket. Four thirty nine. Yes. And four dollars and thirty nine cents a gallon for diesel. Now we gotta pay it. But it sure don't feel good knowing what diesel used to be, so. They're trying to go up on the price. It's only going to be low now, man. Yeah, so now's the time, you guys. You got to negotiate and, and 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 figure in diesel, the cost of diesel going up in your prices with, with, a, with the broker you're dealing with because we can't accept the same pay. And, well, we, and everything is going up. Well, we can, but... Gotta, we can't accept it now. Well, yeah. Saying, you know, Maybe I should have said we can't accept it. So trying to get more power, you know, everything going on. Right. It's a good bargaining tool. Diesel's going up when you're on the road. The hotels have gone up. Food has gone up. Use these as your bargaining tools to get more money for your pay, so you don't feel like you negotiated a bad deal or. You didn't get what you were worth or something like that. Ain't that right, babe? Yeah, that's what I'm thinking, you know. I, I, I need to have a little bit more, man, because it, it costs it. It costs it even just to get out and crank, crank your uh, truck up. Yeah. Yeah. They, they should know that. So, just a little tip for how to, how to negotiate for more money. You know, use what you got. And, and it's really a legitimate concern with the cost of fuel and everything the way it is. So, anyway, we're pulling up to the shipper here in a minute. Uh, we'll get in and get uh, checked in and see you guys in a minute. Thank you. I always stop at the guard shack and get checked in before I go into the shipping office. Not at every... Um, that's Lucille. Not at every business will they even have a guard shack, but here they do. That's what it looks like. And so we always stop there to get checked in there and then go into the ship. Jacksonville. Six two five eight zero. Okay. Are you in a box truck? Yes, sir. So y'all use zero one or something? Yes, sir. All right, they sent us to door seven. I called my husband and let him know he should already be there. 
and it was right at 7 a.m. So let's see how fast it takes us. No sleep, no rest. Might crash, might wreck. But first die. Stretch. Tell him run it out of ten, rub through my hands, I'm by my lonely. Turn to a savage, now my baby wants to hold me. I love my fans, don't need no friends, I got my homies. Thought I could trust you, I find out you tried to zone me. I'm number one up on that court, I'm Nick McGrady. The first one in, the last one out, can't call me lazy. Put in my hours, send the invoice, and they pay me. I need six rings like MJ and Tom Brady. All right, y'all. We at Doctor Number Seven today. Again today, we was at Doctor Number Seven last week, hadn't we? Mm -mm, I thought it was at seventeen. Something like that. I thought we were at seven last week. No. I don't know, but we had Doctor Number Seven today. Um, didn't have an issue with the paperwork. I thought we was because <laughs> it took him a minute to find the paperwork. I said, Oh goodness. Here we go again. Here we go again, but he found it. I think it was in the wrong. 17 and they are finished. We got here at 7 a.m. They finished at 8 17. Let's go get our BOL. Got our seal and our paperwork. Let's go. All right, we got our seal and our paperwork. Let's put that in our, in our compliance binder. Always keep your paperwork in your binder because if you get stopped, that's one of the things that DOT is going to verify is what's on your, what load is on your truck. Even if a seal is on it, as we found out with the level one inspection, they broke the seal and then put their seal on it, but they verified that what was on our paperwork is in the back of the truck. Go in, use the restroom. Head of the floor, y'all. Hey to the people. <laughs> He's so retarded. Sometimes. See, see, I gotta be retarded. Yeah. That's why. That's why you put that ring on your finger. Cause I will retard. Yeah. That said a lot about you, now. <laughs> Made it a bunch.
get to the location. Two ish two things happen. First thing is it turned off. It's still flashing red. Let's see. We're trying to reboot our um ELD. Um it's given an error. We we attempted to switch from my husband to myself so that we could share driving and uh I'm gonna turn it off, huh? Yeah. And uh, I'm trying to tighten it back up. And um, it, it wouldn't allow us to. It gave an, an error. ELD. Um, ELD synchronization data diagnostic event. This is the first time we've experienced this ever. So I don't see that being the case. It says engine synchronization malfunctions will clear on their own after 24 hours have passed since the last logged malfunction so my husband drove all the way here from home so we need to give him a break we're going to uh try to reboot this it says keep it down for five minutes um so we're going to try to reboot it and um see if i can log in we need to stay off for at least 30 minutes because we're going to go ahead and take our 30 minute break in the system um, before we log back in and hopefully that'll do it. If not, we'll just have to switch to a paper log so I can drive. And do the last thing that it says, contact um, Keep Trucking Support. So. And the, that was the biggest issue. The other issue was when we got here, there was an 18-wheeler in our spot. Now, our appointment was 6 o'clock. So I went inside and they made him move basically because his appointment window is from between 8 a.m. and 12. So since our appointment is specifically at 6, we got to go first. Anything else, honey, about That's the same thing that happened with us. When we, we got here, at, he had an appointment at 6. Yeah, one time before and, and our appointment was later and they made, they made we up, were here. We they made, they up, made us move. <laughs> So, so we got not, that little bit back. Not this time, but <laughs> that was a while ago. But we got it back. That was in the it. summertime. Yeah, yeah, but we got it back, y'all. I'm just about to go in there, some man. Now, okay, I can understand. I can understand what you're doing right now. But when I was here, right, and I was in this spot, I had to move. Y'all told me to move. <laughs> Cause my apartment time was, was a little late. later than yeah. here. So, so. But we got in our spot, so hopefully we can get on back on, on the road and get on home. We're not staying this time. We're going to get on down the road. Gas prices check. I, uh, the roof, I had to pay $5 a gallon down here, man. Four ninety nine, dollars just paid it. Five gallons. Got to do what you got to do, $5 but it don't feel good. Wow. Yeah. $5 a gallon. Mm. And, they, and don't get me wrong. There are some places where it's more expensive than that. I know... The news in California was six ninety nine, dollars you know, so they're paying $7 a gallon in California. Some places are six something, some places are five something. We passed several truck stops on the way here that were five twenty seven. That was the highest I think I've seen. So, you know, you got to do what you got to do, but it don't have to feel good because it sure don't feel good putting $5 a gallon in the tank. Wow. And we put $100 worth in the tank. Yep. Man. Yep, so. Unbelievable. Unbelievable. All right, y'all. See you in a minute. We got unloaded at about 7.15, which was really quick, really fast. We plugged up the ELD. One half it's still not working right. for me. He can log in even though he gets an error. I can't even log into the vehicle. So we are headed back home. Poor hubby is still driving. Sad, cause he tired. I know he tired. But we headed back to the house, you guys, and we'll keep you posted. Baby, I'm a soldier, standing my ground So if you're gonna find me, put my heart All you're gonna get is battle scars Baby, 
I'm a psycho, 27, eight. Maybe I'm a rifle, one bite you dead So if you're gonna fight me for my heart All you're gonna get is red or dark What can I say any more than desire? More than just a pretty face So girl you better walk away Oh yeah, oh yeah Only one love if it's harder than fire Someone who can handle me Someone got your heart to be Oh yeah, oh yeah If you try to come closer I'ma give you some closure Before you know it, it's over So run away, run away I'm not trying to hurt you But I will if I have to I'ma tell you what I do Run away, run away I'm a fighter, never backing down Maybe I'm a soldier, stand in my ground So if you're gonna fight me for my heart You guys, we made it back uh, to our city Turning on our street here in a little bit So we just wanted to end the video here I know we didn't have a whole lot of adventure today But hey, we made this load and we got back safe So today was a good day we had some adventure, them gas, them, them fuel prices. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah, man. The highest we've seen today is $5.49. $5.49 at the lows that we just passed. Um, close to the Florida, the highest I saw was $5.27. And the highest that we paid was $4.99. Yeah. How in the world? How can you survive like that? Use your gas buddy apps. Use your uh, discounts at places like Circle K, Racetrack, wherever they offer um, disca discounts and um, change off. Of mile, if, turn left. if you don't have the Get Upside app, Get Upside. <laughs> I'll put it down in the description box below. It gives you cash back off your gas purchases. Hey, fuel, you know. Looks like yep. fuel is steady going up, so. Fuel may be not take no more loads. <laughs> <laughs> so do what you gotta do to get as much as you can off, okay? All right, see you guys in the next video.